What's up everybody? We're back, three pound fishing. Late day fishing trip. We're just gonna hang out, see what we can find tonight. The water's definitely cooling, which is gonna make it for a much better bite. I mean, we've dropped about five degrees, which is totally cool. So stick with me. This is the beginning of fall fishing on YouTube. Three pound fishing, here we go, baby. So as we get to our spot, you can see there our temperature, you know, it's going up a little bit at 77, but right now that's about, that's roughly about five degrees difference this time of day. So water temperatures are totally dropping right now. We've had some nice cool evenings. And as we know, that means that there's crappie bites just gonna get continue to get better and better and better. So uh, I think today that's what we're, uh, I think it's gonna happen folks, I really do. We got the old Hammer 10, big time, check it out. and. Uh, yeah, let's put some fish in the boat. And there's our first fish. Solid eater. Solid eater right there. They all go back here on three pound fishing, but let me, uh, let me just tell you, fall time, we all talk about it. These fish can be everywhere. Now check these guys out. These guys happen to be 12 foot down. There's a bunch of them. We know that these are probably a little, probably the eater size right here. If I want to target bigger fish, I'm going to come down here in this area right here. But during the fall, the big thing is that these fish are everywhere. I'm just telling you right now, you can be shallow. You can be deep. These fish are everywhere. And right now we're, we're at a sweet spot. That's 78, I guarantee in the morning, I'm gonna fish in the morning, and uh, that, that water temperature is gonna be somewhere in that 73 range, especially starting the day off. Temperatures right now in the evening are dropping down to roughly around 50, sometimes even cooler than that. Oh, baby. Guys, if you wanna do some guide trips, we've got some guide trip dates still available. As I clean this up, let's see, look at that. That's a good solid area right there. Mm -mm -mm. Look at these, these guys are super deep. 14 foot, look at them way down there totally down in the mud so we're hoping for good things out of this we targeting trying to find some bigger fish definitely got fish on the piles Let's see if i get one of these guys to react to it <laughs> can't quit i got him man did i have to play him he ain't the biggest fish he marked pretty good though which is kind of funny but man he was aggressive i had to play him Easy peasy, baby. Fall fishing. Fall fishing, don't get much better. Gosh, dang. All right, guys, I'm gonna show the loop knot real quick as we move to our next spot. Um, 132nd ounce, bring it through the eyelet right there. And then basically, gonna just turn it around about four or five times and then bring it right back through that gob of stuff that we were holding. And then we're gonna tighten it up right there. And you got your perfect loop knot. Now this is the sniping braid, optimal. It's incredible for casting. So consider it, it is uh, just a great braid. If I were to go with another braid on maybe some of the lakes where I'm gonna be vertical jigging, I'm gonna go with that optimized or that 12 pound. So check that out. And, uh, and always a paddle tail with a 30 second ounce jig.
Yeah, that's a good one. Nice, nice eater fish. Look at these marks right here. I got a monster that's on that pile right there. Uh, it might turn into two. That's a nice eater fish. Looking around. There's fish everywhere, people. You gotta love fall fishing. This I'm getting better. And the weather's not. Oh yeah. Just casting them at 30 feet. That's good fish. With the blue monkey right there. Blue monkey off the website. That's the light sniping braid too, man. Super smooth, crazy stuff right there. That uh, blue monkey though, that's been a good one. Now our, our next uh, event's going to be Grenada for the championship for the Elite Series. So stay tuned guys, it's gonna be freaking awesome. Um, who doesn't like Grenada, man? I don't care. Even if it's early fall, those fish will still be big. And it'll be an absolute shootout. Um, Cause you know people are gonna catch some big fish. <laughs> so Grenada, Mississippi Elite Series, look for that episode. It's co they're coming, there's gonna be quite a few of them. So um, man, you can't beat this, this fall weather. So. Um, if you're interested in guide trips, please give me a call, 618-694-5162. Look at these guys totally on top of a rock. This is crazy. Those are good fish, man. This is a good spot. Let's see what happens. Yes, sir. Feeling it all with that three pound fishing hammer tin. You guys can get that hammer tin at, uh, on the website. About to be, about to be uh, coupled up with the new 13 footer. It, the new 13 footer will be here by uh, sometime in October next month but we're gonna release it probably november 1st it's probably gonna be the release date it is an incredible thing now let me i'm gonna tell you right off the bat for those that have gone through this video long enough you deserve some additional information that the people that left won't get it is going to be a game changer an absolute industry game changer that um and i've had some people like say well, what can you be doing to a fishing rod you will see that's the fun part about it all it is a uh, oh my gosh he did hit it it's the fun thing about it folks this one is going to change how people look at people providing it. man what a beautiful night man i'll tell you right now so i've got a lot of guide trips coming up in the month of october um, and some here in september but i do have some space left and i'll tell you a lot of these guide trips we don't even start early in the morning we'll actually start in the afternoon because during the fall the bike can go throughout the entire day. It doesn't not really matter if you get out there bright and early, but most people want to, so they get done early, which I completely get it. Uh, but that's the beauty of the fall bike. They could be at any depth. They could be during any time of the day and you can still catch fish. We've caught fish this entire time. Every pile has got fish on it and it's been fun. So anyway, consider a, consider a guide trip, three pound fishing, um, 618-694-5162 and um, we're definitely gonna put slabs in the boat. Fall is my favorite time. So is winter though, I gotta tell you, so is winter. Crappie everywhere, crappie everywhere. 